Caustic actually kind of is a bad spot right now to have, a bad character to have, because you're not really raiding any buildings or like sieging any buildings. A lot of teams are playing edge, so oh Caustic my, on edge kind of becomes pointless, right? So Exo's going to be fighting LG here, man. GHS might be walking into the boys and Harvester too. Dexter is going to get knocked here, and Yanya is going to get the knock with the Q on the Valk, man. And Valk Q is low-key pretty good. We're going to switch over to Yanya, man. The main slayer for LG. This guy is a tank, a powerhouse. And you know what the craziest part is, bro, that no one talks about? He's this, getting these knocks. Everyone thought this guy was cheating when he first came over. And he proved everyone wrong and is now a top NA slayer. A top slayer in the world. That is one hell of a comeback story, It's crazy bro. how much can change. Yeah, right? And Kick and GHS actually trading in the kill feed here. Yeah, it's going to be APAC North versus South America here. And we're going to have Kings. Getting the crack. He's also getting cracked himself. And he's going to be going down. Genji Genji. getting two knocks. Double knock here. And it's going to be a 1v2. And this is not going to be easy, man. As a Watson here, trying to stay alive in a 1v2 is very difficult. And we see even more fighting at this godforsaken POI. I, this POI makes me sick to my stomach, man. Here and comes a double swing. This the knockdown providing some good cover. Though the Eva going nuclear. Oh my gosh! Oh my god, he almost, he almost just does. went stupid. If he gets that knock creek, he, if he wins that, he wins that. Simple as that. He gets that 1v2. That is it. JHS would have got clutched on and they would have got put on the bird. That was absolutely 10 insane. HP. Oh my it doesn't look like they do, Greek, and they're going to be able to get out, man. They're actually going to get that rotation in as Roz and them are still looking for more shots in this backside. And I don't really know what Vex or Exo wants to do here. They're going to have to fight the boys over in front at IG. And there's going to be a shit sandwich going to start going down over in the Lava Vista area, Greek. Yep, CR watching the zone close in here. They have GHS on their back. they got to hold them out. And here we go. Exo is going to take this fight, baby. Dexter going down to 1 HP, and Dexter does go down to Matafe in the back. There we go. Dexter is eliminated. Matafe does get the knock here. That's a great job. Vex actually making some power moves finally, Greek. They're finally making a play here, kid. And kill up. It goes down as well. It is up to Ziki in the top floor of the house. It's not looking too good, and Exo's going to get eliminated there, too bro. vexed. But I believe there's a third party coming yeah, in. Yeah, and GHS actually gets eliminated, bro, by CR. CR with a great web on that backside. As we switch over to Vexed, two fights simultaneously happening. And G freaking G to the boys at GHS, man, running into APAC North powerhouse CR. Yep, the zone does pull to the north. It is ending on IG. Let's go, let's I mean, zone call from them. Yeah, it's a great zone call by IG, Greek, but... I think NRG is even a better spot, bro. That Sony's egregious, Greek. I don't know what's going to happen. Vex is now fighting ESA for this top spot, and Luna's going to be going down. Vex, both. Is that a rev silence coming that in? That is a rev silence coming in. Someone must be KCP coming in. KCP and the party. Rebel this third. Oh my in. god, and KCP coming into grief, baby. You love to see it, or you don't. One of the two. They're now dying in their ultimate, and this is the problem with Revenant. Fnatic eliminated. IBG comes up to oh third party. The totem man. And KCP is going to be one man down. Vexed is one man up, I believe, as well. And so is ESA. This is a shit sandwich with E6 now fighting on this backside as well. Oh CR is doing such a good job fighting. They have so much to work with. And they're the team to watch, bro. But there's so much action going on. We just oh can't keep God. up. ESA gets the full reset. Panda's going to get a knock on Onik. And this is going to be absolutely insanity breaking out over in the Lava Fisher area. The zone four is closing here with 25 seconds left and we are seeing everyone trying to desperately stay and alive. And CR now taking the fight too. We're going to go back to Roz. Multiple fights breaking out on opposite side of the map. Roz. The horizon Q. It looked a little bug there and Whisper's going to go down. It's up to Parka. Oh no. And right when we switch over to the caster curse, Parka going to be the last one alive. A horizon Q on the back. And they're going to go down. It's going to be fun now taking out CR along with Ascend. Ascend going to walk in on the fun here. And that's a hell of a wide swing from the boys. Kron, last one alive. And Ascend. And they get the clear. With a very aggressive push as Energy and LG are going to be touching tip. Uh, touching stomachs here, man. Trying to get the fight over on the outside of glass. Yeah, that zone pull is insane. Yeah, agreed. 100% agree. This zone is pretty bad. It is not an easy one to play at all. But Sweet getting two knocks onto LG. Yeah, and Sweet's going to start this fight up, bro. we got to switch over right now. And Sweet's going nuclear with the Rampage. He's one of the best with that gun, man. Him and Abrolli are really just built different. And Luminosity just goes down. Energy with the wipe. And they're the team to watch right now, Greek. They have the height. They have the... 
the height along with Ascend, KCP eliminated. We gotta watch energy. Yeah, I mean, NRG's Pryo here is most likely going to be a potential oob from the teams at Lava Fissure. Correct. They're gonna walk it in from the alleyway. And I think the win condition here for NRG is can they bully the opposite team and control the height of the bridge? Yeah. If they are able to control that, that should be an easy win for them, but they have to play super, super late and hold their back out first. Yeah, if that Valkulti comes in off the oob, NRG's whole game could just be lost. It does not matter about their front. If their backside does get Valkulti on, man, they can lose this game quite quickly. Singularity is now Valkulti in, trying to find a spot to play. The guard is going to be getting knocked, and the guard is indeed eliminated. But look at NRG, man. So much height control. They have to low look shots. everything. They have free shots, but they're missing out on the KP. E6 is going to knock Singularity here, bro. And NRG looking for more shots again. E6, though, still alive. And and them just still fighting on this backside, man. Ascend still up top as well. And E6 knocks Iron Blood Gaming. They are oh on a fucking God. rampage right now, man. E6 looking fantastic. Along with Ascend up top. It's gonna be Ascend versus NRG. And Greek, I think whoever wins this fight, I think they actually just win this game. Yeah, I mean Kashera's gonna go down here to the missile swarm. They slap the Watson Gen down, but NRG is looking to get the finisher. They are walking up because they want the clear for the high ground. And there we go. Sweet with the Volt. A little bit of a different look for the kid right now. And they're looking to wipe out and push down through Ascend. Ascend does jump off the height. And now it's just NRG, man. The lone Ultimate height. team at height all by themselves. Top Triple four scenario. Triple red armor looking like some raid bosses. That's what I'm saying, man. Three teams alive, one duo, and you got to feel bad for the rest of this lobby. The Rampage... <laughs> Ramped up, and they're fucking me like off a monster right now, man. That's how the rampage is. Me yep. off the caffeine, that's me. I'm the rampage. I'm that we guy. We have three EU teams and one NA team here. Yeah. E6, Ascend, NRG, and IG, who we saw in Godspot in the house first. They make a crazy rotation, and they're on the ultimate low ground right now. Just yeah. really good at World's Edge. A Revolt gets smacked down from oh, E6. No. And look at this Revolty coming out for E6, bro. They're looking to make something happen on the top side. It's a very early Revolty, Greek. You think they would have saved that maybe towards the later of the game? Or do they have ulti cells to make it work? Yeah, I think that is indeed an early rotate there. The Crypto ulti comes out too, and they're looking to silence these teams on the right side. Oh, that team is going through. And that's going to be a send who is a duo. They get taken out. IG and NRG pick up one kill each there. And look at this, bro. E6 with the Octane Rev, bro. Still alive. They're trying to push the backside right now of oh, this spot. Not Amphi going down. Sweet energy getting some more KP. And it's going to be free low for the boys. Yep, NRG here, like we said, with ultimate high ground. They're going to look to clean this fight, and then they're going to have a straight-up 3v3 against IG. And IG, I don't think, has a horizon here, Greek, right? So they're going to be stuck down below. And NRG, just free shots, big dog. And E6 is eliminated, but I think IG is still a three-man up, Greek. Yep, and NRG, we said it before this game started. They need a big game here. They're on the middle of the leaderboards. Oh, my goodness. And they're going to have to walk through zone here. It's going to be the last one. And NRG with one more. It's going to be way too easy for the boys. An anticlimactic ending, but it's going to be a good one for NRG. They get some KP. They're looking for some more right now. Going to the backside. My man Sweet well, just he, looked he like just me needed with my a touch. I know, now when I know. he dies the storm, they get the KP. Yeah. And NRG are going to be your game for winners. Yeah, quite easily as well, man. That height was just so perfect for them. Not much other teams could do. Guild trying to get the KP again. He rounds to the backside. And Energy is your game for champion. Make sure you guys go shut up, dude. It's deserving. All right, here we go. EXO versus DZ contest number two. Lag out? Uh, no, it, happens. Duo again. It, it always does that. I don't know why. But here we go, chat. DZ versus EXO. Who do we think is going to win off spawn, chat? Put your team to win right now in this contest. If they fight, that is. They might not even fight. They might just. Uh, I'll watch EXO. Yeah. Run away. You're gonna watch XO? Down. Let's watch it, baby. Let's lock it on in. I think, what do you think, Greek? XO or DZ, real quick? It looks like DZ has the jump on the middle, though. Yeah, they do, but is the middle better? It has to be if they're making them go there. The Yarge Mozam for Jenburn. Yeah, they do have a, a, a wingman option. Oh, my goodness gracious. Zero and Sharky getting cracked. The up. purple armor, though. Yeah, my man just found the. Zero's gonna go down to Zicky. It's gonna be a 2v3 yep. here for Dark Zero. And I'm telling you right now, man, Zicky and Exo are no slouches mechanically. I said it. They are so underrated when it comes to mechanics. They are phenomenal, phenomenal players. But Jen Burn has to be the difference maker here, Greek, with the purple armor R301. Yeah, Jen, if they are to win this 3v2, has to go insane. Yeah. But I don't think they're gonna be able to do it. No, Jen is looking for some angles here. He might wanna pop out on this left side, and when that door opens, bro, they get a little bit of angles. But I think he's nervous about getting wrapped on and these doors. 
scores, but he has to be aggressive in this situation or let Exo make a mistake. But Exo is getting angles first, and this is where it could be bad for Jen Burton. Jen does, Jen get, a does get a knock here, and we're gonna have the boy, Sharky, last one alive in a 1v2. He and can't man, even see what's going on. My man has no idea. He just got a fucking napkin over his face, and he had no idea what was happening, bro. Yeah. Fun one, two, three is insanely split. Yeah, they are. What are they doing right now? NRG is walking in on them. Yeah, this is bad. Fun could actually go down here, Greek, if they get caught off guard. This could be pretty tough. And Doctor Strange with his sights set with that 30-30. Oh, my. Armor swaps coming out from Zenjun. I don't think he's going to be able to stay alive. He does not. And they're getting looked at, bro, by not only NRG. Three teams. Not only the guard, but they are also getting looked at by KCP. Yeah. Three fucking teams staring at these guys, man. The and fact that they just got that Obli just got out of there is insane. Yeah, I mean the of course the one movement non movement character does not make it out of there alive. The classic that would have been me and I would have mauled it that whole time, bro, playing Watson or something. It's the worst situation, bro. When your teammates are like, just get here. It's like, how do I get here, man? You want me to fence when I'm walking? How do you expect me to make it when you have a horizon cue with zero gravity and then a fucking double time octane passive? That pisses me off, man. I've, yeah. I've got that way too much. Why are you dead? What do you mean, why am I dead? I don't know if they're going to be able to get that banner, man. That is a tough spot. Yeah, it's definitely going to be a tough spot. They don't have a crypto either, so I think that banner just might be chalked. You know, energy's going to hard focus that. Benefit of your fights. And y'all just be like, yo, how do I there get better? The Cyril. And then feed face. The Valko, 100 spray from Luda. That's a great job by Luda. It's another 36. They got to get that knock. They don't get the knock, but Luda with some great damage, man. And they're going to make it out. I cannot believe that they do not get that at all. And on the other side of the map, near Thermal, we have LG fighting Exo over near staging. I actually heard Phony just yell, how did we not kill him? Did you actually hear that? Yes. Yeah, I have no idea, but Luda was not the culprit in that situation. That had to be Cody missing the jitter aim. Oh, man, that is a wasted opportunity there. That could have been 3kp. And Bess is actually going to get a Mastiff kill onto Matafe. Yeah, that's a great job by Bess here, man. Singularity Matafe taking a fight right now. I don't even know where that is. It's over here on the backside near Lava Fisher. Singularity with the wipe. And there it is, South America wow. showing up and taking down one of the best EMEA teams fight-wise. And now Kick is fighting ESA again over on this backside. And it's going to be another South American team looking forward to wipe NA. 2v2 here, I believe, or a 2v3. The Horizon all comes down and sucks him back into the wall. Luda's going to get the knock with the car, and it is up to Van Van. Yeah, and kick again, man. Their 3v3 is not going too well. They are struggling, and it looks like they're going to go down yet again. And ESA wipes out the boys over a kick, and Chad is now reporting that Zane, even though we didn't get to watch it, just had a 1v3 main stage. Oh, my God. Unbelievable. Zane. And the boys, bro, coming in big here too. And IBG is going to take a fight over at Skyhook. And this is where the snowball starts, Greek. Everyone's going to start taking these fights. It's very important now. Yep, IBG very, very low here. They're looking to stabilize. They got a building. We still have 17 squads alive, chat. Yeah. A lot of teams up here, chat. And don't forget, man, once a one team fights and the third party start to roll in, it's a, it's a mad Mackie ball. It just does not stop. It's an unstoppable force, bro, that... You just want to start feeding. You want to start fighting because you see all these teams doing the same thing. It's kind of like a bad influence type vibe. NRG, though, is going to get a charge rifle knocks. And looking at that, E6 dies to two different charge rifles Dude, from charge far rifles. away. Slayer's dead to best charge rifle, and Swinney dead to the boys over at NRG's charge rifle. I mean, that gun, Send Greek, eliminated. we might have to talk about that gun just a little bit more here, big dog. We really might because that gun is absolutely – is you think do you consider the charge rifle broken? Yeah, not a great game for IT. They're also not doing too hot right now in this lobby. They're not doing amazing. And they have to make some plays here moving forward into this last game. They have to figure something out. But NRG going to be killing Singularity here, bro. And they're getting aggressive. Sweet is going to be 1 HP. And they wipe Singularity. Just like they I take said. that spot immediately, like you said. Yeah, NRG realized there that they were in a spot that they needed to pivot from. They had two options to either back up to the house or fight the hallway. They opt for the hallway and they get, it pays dividends because they just got three armor swaps and more loot. Are they in here though? I cannot see on the map at all if they are I in. I don't believe so, but I, I think, think they shift one more hallway over yeah. to the left. Is anyone in that hallway, Greek? Is that hallway available? I don't know if it is actually. It's going to be Geo maybe on that hallway right now. LG now fighting above them. NRG looking for some, oh my goodness. There it is, baby. Killed with the classic one clip with the two times flat line. Not much to do better than him. And they're going to wide swing. They want to wipe this team. They want to clear their whole edge. Yeah, NRG playing their LOSs here really, really well. They notice there are a lot of people 
Can they make it back? Oh my god, Sweet is in full panic mode right and now. That's just wide swinging. Yeah, I don't know who that is, but that team is getting aggressive. Energy might have lost their spot. It's going to be the boys at GHS now dying up top to Fnatic and Gonbare. And GHS is eliminated. Energy still trying to find their way in. Yeah, I mean, they either have to rotate all the way back around and fight for the choke or try to play for that backside of Raven, but it's looking like they're going to go back to the other choke. Yeah, and they only have 24 seconds now, not they even to make Valkyl? a play. And they might actually Valkyl to here. Fnatic now is looking to kill their whole backside near Skyhook. And IBG going down. It's going to be ESA and IBG trading and fighting. LG gets the knock on the guild. So energy is going to be a two-man up. And look at Fnatic, oh, man. Oh, my God. Just they're picking up all the kills. They're getting all the KP here, man. Look at the shots and the grenades ESA from those ESA eliminated, man. and they're going to pick up the last of the kills. Oh, my. The and that's going to be IBG eliminated. Oh. And Fnatic doing a phenomenal job to clear their side. Yeah, and that's a great job by Fnatic, like you said. But Case... KCP now looking to come over, and Energy, the team to watch here still after a great last game, is just trying to stay alive in any way. The Watson Gen goes down, sweet. It's gonna go down to the Thermite, and it is up to Nathan. Oh no, it's not looking good, kid. He actually might go down here. How is he not getting shot right Nathan now? Nathan doing everything he can to stay alive. And, I mean, he's doing a pretty good job, Greek, if we're being honest, bro. This is actually a great job. We do have the guard now holding out three teams. Nathan is trying to stay up. He's going to get the bat off, but look at the guard now. There are four teams fighting up here. Fnatic is now fighting KCP up top again. Oh it's an absolute God. shit show. Panders in a 1v1, I believe, against Fnatic. Whoever wins this, bro, could win the game. We've seen so many good 3v3s. I believe it's Roller versus Roller as well. The armor swaps are already taken, and the boy Panders is doing a great oh job. Oh, my God. Panders has to swing it. And, and Panders it goes down goes to Yuka. And it's not controller versus controller. It's going to be Yuka. And they're now dying to Exo. Oh, my God. Yuka going to have to 1v3 Exo here. We have not seen it one time yet here in the B stream. The Prowler. And there is it not is. Enough. Exo comes down and third parties the boys over. At, KC, at uh, KCP and the guard and lost their spot. And as they're watching that, man, the guard does lose their spot. Nathan, though, still alive just oh as a solo. My God. LG up top. CR in a great, great spot for late game. Oh, my God. The 121 I from love Yandy. It, baby. I don't need to keep shooting that big dog. Come on now. Hit some more headshots. You got this. My favorite gun in the game. No questions asked. 13 on 14 under damage, bro, with a 2K. They spot the rat, which is Nathan there. Yeah, and that is a, that is a Watson. No, they're not going to actually spot him. I think Nathan might have moved. We see. Could always be worse. Rambo alive is the only rat in the game. Yeah, it's going to be Ram the And a Rambo is from dead Yanya, from Yanya. Bro. You are cursed, my guy. You is are. That, that's my second one, and you've gotten one too. Yeah, we have three oh curses so God. far. Rambo immediately gets put down, bro. Good lord, you just cursed the shit out of that guy. My man's about to just smoke the Newport real quick. He's got already got the pack out. He's it's it's literally it. peeking out yeah. the pocket. He's already ready to rip it. That's all he wants, man. Coffee and a smoke, and he's good to go. All right, we have CR up top here, Greek, along with LG. Most likely, we're going to see an LG versus CR fight breaking out. The and here goes CR. Ball, baby. The nade spam off the horizon queue, and they got to be forcing this team off the height. Oh, my God. The grenade's just going down. I don't even know if they're doing damage, though. The grenade's not really doing much, the Greek. The caustic of LG. Oh my goodness, there is no oh way LG God. is holding that as good as they did, but it is indeed true. Those grenades did no damage, Greek. What even happened there, Big Dog? Yeah, I think the Arc Stars did not make it far enough, and LG was able to get the cover behind the boxes, and the caustic really, really helped them out yeah, there. Yeah, you're not wrong, That's man. That's why they're playing them. Yeah, you're not wrong, but look at this now, Greek. Exo starts to move up, and Exo taking full control of this bridge area, and this is where LG is going to really struggle. Good Gombray shots on the far Yanya. left. Yeah. The Bangle is going to stun all three of them here, though. Yeah, I don't know if they have a, a Caustic ulti. I don't think they, I think they used it already on the CR. I don't agree with that ulti, Greek. In order to stay alive, it's still not worth it in my mind. Exo is getting knocks on the Juicena. Juicena is going down. Yeah, Luminasi doing a good job here to play small. They're letting all the other shots break loose. They have no Bloodhound ult, no Caustic ult. But they yeah. do have one thing, and that's the knowledge of where everyone's at. And it's heart. It's passion. They do have that indeed as well. And they're going to go down. Good Lord, Greek. We need to shut the fuck up. Exo now going to move up top, bro. They're going to try to stay alive. Jumping down. And get some KP here. LG does get the full kills on Nagambare. But I think this is going to be another easy countdown win for another team. Oh, my Exo. God. And look Exo at this. cleaning it up right now. Nizul is trying to get the reset off here, but Exo is most likely going to get a free W here. Yeah, it's going to be a 2v3 right now, and 
EXO playing passive on the LG, but they're still getting the KP. EXO with the W. I love to see an EXO win, man. One of the most mechanically underrated teams in the game. 100. The nades coming in. Yeah. The mod weapons. Oh my god. Graceful wide swings and just gets absolutely smoked. Yeah, Graceful. 39 years old, bro, trying to play the game. Not really working out in his favor right there. GHS is also fighting Singularity. But I think DC is going to get aggressive, Greek. They recognize that IG is down as well. And they may be able to wipe IG and kick and have total control of Geyser. Yeah. Kick's dead, and Singularity's dead. Two South American teams now down. 18 squads with 54 left, and they're going to get the rest. DZ wide swinging on the IG here, and Jen Burton gets another knock onto JMW. Graceful gets finned, and it is now up to noises. And now CR is going to wipe out GHS, and this game, Greek, is off to a fiery start. It is a shit sandwich, as you would say, big dog. Oh, my goodness, brother. DZ finding themselves in the middle of the shit storm, but they're weathering the tide. Yeah, I mean, strafing flame. They do have digis. R301 wing. I think they are going to listen to what you said and wait out this serial. That's what I would do. Yeah. It's a hard shot I would do. But either way, this is a tough push. Yeah. This is not an easy one to make, bro. I, I think this one the Oh, they're going for it. And the climb up from Strafe and Flame. Nice. I mean, the climb up is great. They also see the blue armors, man. Oh, and he just climbed right oh into the Oh, my God. DC pump. knocks a send in the top right. They get the full wipe here as this fight's going on. IBG trying to make it work. This is not an easy fight, Grief. Gonbare eliminated. And here we go. Gonbare is going to be going down. It's going to be ESA with the third party as IBG is still now full healing, man. Oh, my God. ESA is actually in a pretty tough spot, Grief. I do not like that's how they're playing this. That's a tough cross. And that's a bad, yeah, bad play. And that's going to be Luda, I believe. Yeah, Luda overextends. It's going to be ESA's downfall here. And now IBG has... What oh the my God! Is that guy doing? That was Pony slithering up the stairs. That Who had that? to be. That had to be somebody just trying to make a crazy play. It's not going to work out really, and they're just going to start to fool you again, man. Yeah, I mean IBG. Oh, there's no like way they don't chase there, this man. Down, God right? damn. No, they have to chase the town. I would immediately chase this for sure. No doubt about it. They're getting the respawn on Luda already. Yeah. I mean, bro, that that's actually like one of the craziest parts about Seer, dude. That I just don't understand. IG. Also with a Valco to here, bro. And they're on the backside. IG in sixth place right now, man. They can Double make a play in the top five. Though. Yeah, they got Graber no in the hands oh of Yuka on Gil. And Gilderson goes down to the hands of Fnatic, bro. And it's going to be Yuka with the Kraber. This is one player you do not want to see. And Guild is full killed. And don't forget, man, fifth, sixth place is only four points behind NRG right now, bro. If yeah. NRG goes out early, they can actually get down out of the top five here quite quickly. Fnatic is your number one team right now. Yeah. They're on ultimate height. Most likely going to pick up even more KP here on the top choke and one of the most dangerous players in the game has a Kraber in hand. Yeah, I mean, uh, everyone asked me on Twitter, a lot of people were asking me what my, or in my stream, bro, who do you think the best player overall in the world is, man? I said Yuka. I don't think there's a better player than this kid. I think he's unbelievable at what he does, one of the most patient players when it comes to Apex, and someone that knows and understands his strengths and wants to work with them. Most players, bro, don't understand their roles and what they're good at, but he does, and he makes it work, and Gombray is going to be going down to ESA somehow with this freaking loop, man. They're actually getting KP, and Luda now has a purple mag, R3 or one and the two to four. And they're getting pushed here, but I believe it's going to be IBG and shot at by Fnatic and yeah. looked at from the guys. ESA here. in a very, very rough spot here. Yeah. Trying to do everything they can. Yep. Luda getting absolutely steamrolled. Phony Head gets eliminated as well, and ESA was just in an unwinnable position. Yeah, unwinnable position, man, and DC is going to get the kills onto them. And DC, man, now at this unwinnable position too, can they make up for it, bro? That's a hell of a wide swing by Strafe. Oh game. my god, and Jen Burton is eviscerating IBG. Absolutely right now. eviscerating, eviscerating. I don't even know the words, bro, but Jen Burton dominating, decimating. Oh my god. IBG and IBG wide swings the wrong controller player, man. They just got put the fuck down. Yeah, Jen Burton absolutely hitting the Batista bomb there onto yeah. IBG. Yeah, 100%. DC is going to land straight onto CR. CR getting a knock onto Zero, and DC is just going to try to run away. Jen Burton going down and. I mean, not a bad energy day for DC, but intense. yeah, energy goes down early, Chad. And like we said, man, they were only four points ahead of sixth place. Yeah, I'm not too sure. It's going to be Onik. Oh, my yeah. God. Fighting wow. Fun. One, two, three. They decide not to coexist, and now Fun is going to get pushed. And Karen Page just got put down by Fussy. Fussy goes big with two. Is he good for three? 
Fussy might be good for three, Greek. He and is. And Yanya actually steals one with the charge rifle. Oh my god, Yanya, an absolute demon. We have Nizu with the, the fucking. And CR ball. actually queues up in third. Team. That is a crazy third from CR, Greek. Do you agree with this play? Yuka with the knock on the Panders. And we're going to see what they want to do. Yuka just saw blood, and now they want it, baby. They want the blood over on this right side. KCP cannot catch a break. Yeah, I mean, Fnatic playing with extreme levels of confidence right now. They have the strongest gun in the game. They're in first place. They're working their way here, trying to get some more KP. And they're looking just for the rats, man. Crazy Raccoon gets eliminated by EXO. And I think that's going to mean energy out of the top three here, Greek. They are now guaranteed out of the top three. LG getting some more kills, though, on the EXO. Maybe not. Caustic Gas, bro. Still doing its thing with EXO, a two-man up, trying to get the res on the opposite side. Yeah, they should be As able to Fnatic reset here. here. The zone is pushing them in, though, and KCP is... Actually, there's nobody on the bridge. Yeah, they might be able to walk into bridge here, Greek as a duo, and that might be the right play. I think they do that 100%. KCP is down underneath them. We have Fnatic on the left side. We have the guard in the building, and on the right, we have LG. I this game. I feel so bad. But no, now, Greek, do you think that Yuka and Fnatic are in a good spot with all yeah, these teams? Yeah, absolutely. I don't absolutely. know, bro. I feel like if they go height, they actually might just die for free by getting focused. They, can, they have options, though. Yeah, you're not wrong. They can go height, they can go low ground and play the wall. Yeah, they just gotta watch out for LG on this left side, Greek. What LG does here with their Caustic Goldie is really gonna dictate the game for FC. F uh, LG is actually climbing for height. Yeah. And they and do here we take go. it with oh the Oh my, Yuka, Yuka getting hyper-aggressive onto them. They're gonna get a knock on the Young Wares, and it's gonna be a 2v3 now for Fnatic. They're gonna get the reset onto the meds, and they're gonna start to push up. The Caustic Traps, though, man, are gonna cause a huge issue, Greek, like we said. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, Guadis, or Nizul has a longbow with no ammo and an alternator. Yeah, they are in shambles right now, but Fnatic is trying to make this work. And they are going to end, bro. This is a very aggressive push, man, for Fnatic. Yuka are they going to make it moving, happen? Bro. Yeah, he is moving. He is dancing like Justin Timberlake in the prime. I've never seen anything like that. And now Fnatic has the height, Greek. But they're getting climbed up on now, too. I believe it's going to be the guard. Who was that seer? That was I have a no idea, push. but you can get it Oh my goodness, we're going to have Exo still alive, baby. Trying to make it work. Exo has the duo underneath, outside. And they're actually in a great spot. Exo doing a phenomenal job to stay up here. The guard trying to stay up as well. Fnatic is going to be eliminated. RKS going to go down. And is Exo going to do it? Are they going to wipe the three men as a duo? Dexter gets knocked in Rambo. And, and oh it's going to be the, the guard. guard wins, baby. Exo almost with the 2v3 clutch. But oh the guard takes God, the W. The guard held that building from the...